Our generation will not have a future. Yes! That's right. Flooding, droughts, extreme heat, mass migrations from unlivable places damaged by climate change, hurricanes in New England, forest fires, will all become commonplace, threatening all of our lives and the lives of low-income, marginalized communities first. Yes! yes. Not only 
only destined to survive, but bring in a new era of the Green New Deal to create a more just and equitable society for everyone. Thank you.
not only write a good policy, but write a framework to actually achieve it. So we set about doing that. The mayor appointed a committee, which I recruited, and sure enough, we went about and not just wrote a net zero energy policy, but a framework to actually achieve it. And, and, and ever since the city council adopted that policy almost two years ago, we've been systematically going about implementing different provisions of it. Yes. Yeah. So, part of that goal, but like I said, when, when they first asked me to get involved to help with single-use plastic shopping bags, I did, but the times had changed. So I proposed something new, something somewhat radical to many, saying, hey, all restaurants in Fort Smith should be composting. When it comes, yes. 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 When it comes to things like single-use plastic shopping bags, we don't need those. Yeah. When it comes to single-use straws, people should be required to ask before they're just handed one. Yeah. 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 When it comes to styrofoam, that's not going away for a long time. We simply do not need it in this day and age. Yeah. Yeah. Over the years, I've been going to Portsmouth High School to speak to the Clippers saying, hey guys, hear what's going on, and you guys became more and more interested. So two weeks ago today, I went to the high school, spoke to about two dozen students, said, guys, Here what's on the, here's what's on the docket. Here's what's coming up in just over a week at City Hall. We will be voting on a citywide ban on styrofoam, which includes a bunch of provisions. Uh, restaurants and city property must compost, no single-use plastic bags, you have to ask for straws, so on and so forth. So guys, I need your help. Yeah. And they showed up in force this past Monday night. Walking in there, because I know I need five votes to pass it, there are four city councilors who I knew supported it. One, however, just given birth to a beautiful girl and she was going to be there. So I had no idea how it was going to go. But thanks to you guys, Woo! it passed. Woo! Woo! So, there's still one more procedural vote when it comes to the citywide styrofoam ban. However, it's going to be enacted and the next city council, whoever's on it, can go back to that ordinance and simply delete three city words. Three simple